Hey, what's good, tribe? Sandman here. I'm just giving you guys an update on Badger. Unfortunately, he's got to go back into the hospital. So he went in a couple of days ago due to kidney stone. And it's blocking uh, his ureters. I struggle from kidney stones all the time. I know what he's going through. I've had two lithotripsies. Um, when I had him, I had 24 on my left, 16 on my right. Uh, he's going to be peeing sand, basically instead of a solid stone because they have to go in up and in instead of cutting them open um, that's like a last resort type deal and uh an 11 millimeter stone got into his bladder oh man that hurts <laughs> i'm sorry bud i hope you get better and that's not the only thing going on he's got a nine millimeter stone now his kidneys are only operating around you know 40 percent filtration you know your kidneys are basically a filter so not i'm not surprised one of his kidneys is blocked off by the nine millimeter and somehow an 11 millimeter made it to the bladder now when a kidney stone's coming through the most painful part the most two painful parts are when it's leaving the kidney and going to the bladder and when it's leaving uh there's only three ways to get it out you urinate it out they go up and in and blow it up and then you urinate sand and then the third way is the worst way they cut your kidneys open and go in through your back now <clears throat> excuse me it shouldn't be long the hospital is you know kind of messing with them and i guess everything's moving slow because of covid19 now he's going back it shouldn't be more than 24 hours when he's out um, usually, as, there, as long as there's no complications, you're, you're good. Um, since one's already in his bladder, it should really only take not long to blow that one up. And wherever the other one is, he's, they got to go up and in and get that too. They blow it up with a laser. Now, that being said, we got a couple interviews, you know, lined up. You know, we, I, I've been really on top of this, been messing with Patreon. You guys, let me know what you want to see. Let me know um, what you want to hear, stories, all this other stuff. Uh, it doesn't just have to be prison stuff. We're a channel of everything, basically. Um, now, all the hardcore stuff goes on Patreon, but whatever you guys want to see, get at me, Sandman2788 at Instagram. Also, check out NateDog916. Check out Prison Break Wall. Check out uh, uh, Fresh Out with Big Herc. And check out uh, Texas Prison Stories. And uh, also, check out Splinter uh at uh prison pov these guys are solid they do a very very good job at what they do support you know support the community but um let's see what else do i need to, uh, what you guys know well if you guys have any questions get at me in the comments like i said probably 24 to 48 hours depending on how fast they get them back in and the urologist and all that come in and perform the surgery um keep badger in your prayers you know i just talked to him he's 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 all there. He's fine. He's just in a lot of pain. So that being said, uh, uh, I think that's it for now. Uh, Isaac part three will be dropping uh, on most likely Friday. Uh, there's another uh, early release for members only right now for Badgers uh, all, just for today. Yeah, uh, man. Plan out in uh But I hope you guys can hear me. So other than that, uh, we got things lined up. We're really going to start pushing Patreon. Check it out. Badgers Heavy Hitters at Patreon.com. Um, check out Badger's uh, Instagram. Uh, I think it's Badger SFV or Badger 818 SFV. Uh, the link is in the des uh, description of the video down below. And some people want it to happen. Some people need it to happen. But heavy hitters make it happen. Nothing but love and respect. Shout out to the tribe.